Overcrowding is just one of many issues facing OKC animal welfare. News 9's Feliz Romero spoke to them about the life-changing funds for our four-legged friends. The city originally allocating $38 million from their MAPS for funding for a new animal shelter, later bumping that up to $42 million. The shelter tells me the new space will help save more animals. <laughs> Uh, when this shelter was built 20 years ago, we moved in this building in 2001. Whenever we b moved into this building, it was new at the time. The city of OKC helping out animal welfare. At that time, animals were, were brought in, held for three days, and then they were euthanized. Life-saving really wasn't happening. Only about 10% of the animals coming into shelters at that time were being saved. MAPS for funding set aside to replace their current shelter with a brand new one. We were fortunate to be one of the 16 projects picked this year to build a new facility. The city says the new shelter will be on city-owned land with adoption and care by OKC Animal Welfare. The whole design was not right, um, and so now that we We've obviously changed and, and we, we are saving more lives and doing our best to save more animals. That's where this new facility is really going to come into play. The new shelter will have a more modern, spacious place for cats to play and at least 50 more kennels for dogs. Not only is it going to be a little bit larger and have a little more capacity, but just the overall design. Um, bigger bigger kennels, for instance, the kennels that our dogs stay in are far too small uh, for, the, for the long length of stay that they have to be here. The vet clinic will also be expanded, allowing staff and pet owners to stay with their animal during appointments. The new shelter will have a space for our field team to have office space and, and areas where they can meet with public. Animal welfare will start the design phase at the beginning of 2023. They say construction starts in 2024. Feliz Romero, Oklahoma Zone, News 9.